Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. here on the bridge of the Normandy and we are looking at the galaxy map and we have arrived in the Hades Nexus and the reason for our arrival as you can see by the tag there is an anomaly all right so here we are in the Hecate cluster it's Hecate people Hecate and we are going to travel to the Sheol system nothing here to scan or it, I think we've been here already and scanned ahead uh, we're at 100% here in Sheol so we have the planet Gehinnom Gehinnom <laughs> all right so anyhow a nearby atmosphereless tidally locked planet orbiting a red dwarf star Gehinnom was the first place human explorers discovered a dedicated Prothean burial ground, while a few sites were saved for posterity. Eldfell Ashland Mining successfully lobbied to scout the rest of the planet for Element Zero, and soon was embroiled in a scandal. Mining teams were looting grave sites, searching for Ezo and other treasures, and many got rich off the so-called cemetery business. While EAM officially brought a stop to the looting, its mining teams remain on the planet, protecting the unclaimed territory and taking their ore to Pam Yacht System for refining. Travel Advisory Armed conflicts have broken out between miners and scientists, staking claims to Prothean ruins. Visitors are advised to employ security while exploring unknown regions of the planet. All right, let's scan and look for a place to land. Oh, we still got uh, some Ezo right here. All right, so it's four. Sounds like a quarry in Scans have found something. All right, surface scans show evidence of a shipwreck meeting quarry in design specifications. Identity of ship unknown. Number of life signs, detect signs detected in vicinity uncertain. Local wildlife may interfere with the accuracy of biological scan. All right, let's get a landing party together. And under other circumstances, I might take Tally since we have a Quarian down on the planet. But I think I remember this mission. It's another one of those horde mode type things. And with her slow recharge rate, we're going to need someone else. And since I have a suspicion what the enemies are, we're taking Grunt. And we will also take Jacob. All right, let's go. Search for survival. Jacob, hit us. Hit me again. And again. 
All right, let's move. Right, just adding our squad incendiary ammo. All right, we've got some palladium, 2,000. Personal logs. Commence pilot's record. We managed to escape the Geth's notice thanks to some clever work in silencing, silencing Sinead's engines. But the strange on, on the old ship was too much. The best we can hope for is to find a friendly spot somewhere in the Sheol system. Our reports show that isn't extremely likely. We were nervous scouting this close to the Perseus Vale. And we were right to be. At this point, I'm afraid we might never see the fleet again. With everything the Sinead has been through, it seems like an ignoble end. Alright, the first few hours the landing was rough, but we managed to salvage from the wreckage the things we need to survive. Unfortunately, Lieutenant Commander Gorlat didn't make it, leaving me the senior officer in charge. We've scouted the landscape and found the planets to be extremely hostile. We don't dare remove our environment suits here. Really? They actually thought about removing their suits? Okay. We're all hoping to be rescued before there's any danger of exposure. I thought they could not remove the suits for fear of sickness and disease because their immune systems are compromised. But anyhow, it's none of my business. I don't know who or what is taking them, but we now lost more than half the crew who survived the crash. We hope to build a camp here to survive until the Idena found our beacon, but something is hunting us. I have to keep the crew together the best I can. We will send out a search party when the day comes. I will find my crew and we will do whatever it takes to return to the Idena. All right, I have a feeling I know what's hunting them. And I'll say it out loud. It's Varen. And that's why I brought Grunt with us. All right, I think we've got... What little stuff that's here. Uh-oh. Oh, this is a cor... Yeah, a dead Corian. Forzan Vos Idena. Where? Oh, here. Forzan? Life signs are stabilized. I recommend securing the area in preparation for shuttle extraction. Okay, there's the Corian status. this again really the thing was barely near her I guess that's all she was already close to death so I guess wow wow all right so we have to stay right there by her side that goes for all of you all right let's um all right let's get these uh Ammo power back on. Alright, I'm going to start off with uh, an SMG. Orion life signs are stabilized. I recommend securing the area in preparation for shuttle extraction. Amp. 
Nothing can hurt me! I'm trying to- Oh my god! You idiot! You're worried about me hitting you, and you're in the way of me saving the s- You god! If you had been doing your damn job, that wouldn't even happen. Wow! Alright, here we go. Ammo power's on. Orion life signs are stabilized. I recommend securing the area in preparation for shuttle extraction. Take three. Come on out here a little bit. Form a perimeter. Shuttle, is there anything else to collect? No me, people. Wow, nothing but death. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, that Corian barely made it. That's why I'm glad I didn't bring Tally, because her cooldowns would have been way too long. But anyhow, barely got through that. I think I'm going to leave in all the, the, the failures, because this was a short mission. So, you know, you can skip through it to the end. You know, we did complete it. All right, so we found and extracted the Corian survivor, notified the Idena of the cyanide. You know I want to say cyanide, but it's Cyniad scout ship location. All right, we got 125 experience. We have 700, 7,500 credits. We have 2,000 palladium and we are back to the Normandy.
right. Let's take a look here. I, I think we're close to our 100% goal here with all of the um, star systems. So let's see what we've got. Ah, the Nubian Expanse when I say that. Oh, that's a hundred. Ninety. Eleven. All right, well, I was wrong. But it should only be, I'm hoping, just a handful. Yeah, look, these are all one hundred. Yes, good. Yay. <laughs> I don't know how many months I've been playing this game. It's, this is something else, how long this is. And it's supposed to be like 35 hours, but, you know, this seems like I've been playing it for a lifetime. Okay, well, we are going to head... to get get my bearings here to the Nubian Expanse. All right, and I will need to scan these systems here and we may find another anomaly. But we will check all that out in our next episode. This is Hill, and I'm out.